<laughs> yeah, that's that's why I'm on, on Twitch to get feedback and ideas from other people. Not just to um, create stuff, but also to get feedback. That's kind of the thing on, uh, for me at least, on Twitch to get um, to interact with chat, to get feedback for stuff you create stuff like that so it's it's completely okay oh okay <laughs> Yeah, that's not good. That shouldn't happen. Maybe you um, don't get that wrong. Um, maybe you rubbed some clothes on something and static um, electricity on you. Or uh, no, no, do that. Okay, one side fixed, other side needs to go still. Okay, um, let's do... Oh, that's, that's definitely not what I want. But just for cleaning seams, I think it's fine. Okay, let's just select them this way. It's not easier, but it's less error prone. <laughs> okay. Okay, all unnecessary seams are removed. Now I can fill these up.
Um, when did I start? Um, I my very first um, streaming encounter was in 2014 when I um, streamed a game that was in early access at that time and I just wanted to play it on, on stream but there, no one came and the only the only visitor I had was someone in game that connected to me and we played a bit together. If you want you can watch that on YouTube, it's horrible and it's ages old. And the next thing was about was somewhere um first two weeks of February where I um, set everything up and then started streaming. First I just wanted to um, do gaming and I played through Rise of the Tomb Raider but um <laughs> Yes, I know. <laughs> um, but I had no visitors, uh, no no viewers, anything like that. And I switched over to game dev and started this project basically. And the rest is, as I say, history. But I haven't reached that far yet so it's and it kind of exploded um, uh, when um, Cry hosted uh, me and raided me and then it kind of exploded but that's my history on Twitch with um, regards to streaming. And I haven't done anything like that before. Um, yep. I know, I know. Um, the only similar experience to that was um, in a um, um, what do you call that um, camp maybe when I was when I was a kid and I um, did a um, few days in in the camp radio station basically but I haven't done anything like this in the meantime and uh, before that so it's completely new to me but I've um, created um, different um, 3d models over the years but n never in a long period of um, time where I could say okay I was I learned it and I practice and I got good at it so um, try to find something old in that regard. Um, do I have it here somewhere?
Okay, I dabbled a bit in um, 3D stuff around um, 2000 to 2004, maybe played around with a bit of stuff then. And I created stuff like that. Yay! Or this But um, this thing here is just a plugin that I was using. And that's just sphere and something created out of primitives. And I didn't create the models here. They were created by other people. But I just applied the f effects on it, basically. There's something else somewhere here. Let me find that. Oh yeah, here we go. Um, can I loop that? That's something I created for a um, role-playing session. It was a computer screen that we saw in a high-tech facility, and that's the, the motto of um, one of the religi religious um, military groups that we encountered. and I created that in 3ds Max and it's also just primitives and a light that's flying around and text mesh which was quite easy to create at that time No, um, peace is might. Would be a translation. And um, the other thing is that um, there's a longer version of that um, uh, slogan or whatever you might call it, and that's um, um, peace through might, basically. So they have a vast army and they bring peace to the galaxy, basically. That's um, 